everyone, Draco Magnus here for another episode of Let's Play Kingdom Hearts 2. In the last episode, we helped Tron defeat a hostile program so the MCP could not destroy Hollow Bastion. And in this episode, we're going to return to the uh, real world. Fun fact, by the way, the hostile program is not a Heartless, as you guys probably figured out, because I didn't put the Heartless number thing on the screen. So yeah, all this time I thought it was a Heartless, but it's not. And the way to figure that out... If we go into characters, hostile programs right there. They don't do that for any other heartless boss. And it doesn't have the heartless symbol anywhere on it. So therefore, it's not a heartless, it's just a program. Very annoying program. Actually, not really. I beat it very easily. I wouldn't call it annoying. Call it evil. Like the MCP. But less. Okay. Excellent. Yeah! That's good. Dude. Why did I say that like I knew? Perhaps you shouldn't say it out in the open. I mean, what if the MCP was listening in? Don't worry, we will. Photon Debugger. Increase damage done by Thunder-based attacks. By the way, I never mentioned it, but I really like the music in there. Oh, <laughs> look at the screen! That's so cool. Hang in there. So, where do we start? Access the BTD. Let's access the TTD. The team checking the situation in town. We'll be back soon, so don't worry. Oh, good. Hey, look. It's asking for a password. Well, that's easy. That's easy, yes. Fora! It's not as long as the old one, but it's still pretty damn long. All right. Whoa. You really trust him with a computer? All right. But I don't think you should, but whatever. Should probably have given him more information, like hit this button, this button, and this button. I would not have trusted Sora with this, but whatever. <laughs> Wait, did they already do it? My god. Pushing buttons does things. Miraculous! Why would this know about that data error? No way. Even Gansom's computer doesn't know. Of course it doesn't know! It doesn't even know who they are! What's the data? I thought I'd ask the computer if they can tell us about their flow bodies. That's a good idea. Again, Goofy is the voice of logic and reason here. Hmm, the entire file. What's this? Of course it is. How about the organization? Of course it is. Don't don't hit it! Don't take your frustration out of the computer, that's not what? Yeah, even though they were just starting to beat the computer up. Exactly like that. That's what I would make my computer say if I could do that. Instead of the data is corrupt. The data is kerfuffled. Come on, are you teasing us again? 
Oh, I'm sorry, I wasn't paying attention. What was that about Ansem the Wise? Wait, that guy's Ansem the Wise? Hmm. What, what? What? Why are... Yeah, in the first game. And technically in Chain of Memories. But that was her too. One explanation later. Nope. Explanation now. Right. Oh. And now you know why I've been calling him Ansem Seeker of Darkness and making 100% certain to say that almost every time I talk about him. Cuz... There's... Wait for it. Okay, come on. There's two Ansoms. This guy and the other guy. It's true. Really? Ah, good question. And maybe the computer knows. Well, to be fair, he has Wise in his name. He, if he didn't know, I'd be surprised. Then again, Wise doesn't exactly mean smart. Smart doesn't mean Wise. He did. Don't tell me there's more. As it is. Of course you are. This is very simple to follow. Yes. Yep. And that nobody leaves the organization, and as I said earlier in this life book. Uh huh. Why are they so surprised? Oh wait, they don't know the chain of memory stuff. Ah, oh. hmm. uh, well that figures. Probably. I mean he has a picture of him in his office. Does that mean Mickey will join our- oh. Outside. Sounds like we've got to start by helping out here. Yep. Yeah. Because we can't let the Ansem Wise. By the way, without spoiling anything, fun fact. Though Mickey isn't going, like, be fully traveling around us, this is, I suppose, in a sense, kind of a spoiler? There, we will actually get to play as him at some point in the game. However, under very, very special situations. And not all the time. Oh. Dang, they broke the thing that was apparently important to the security system. Of course Maleficent would pick now to attack. Well, hey, you know, advantages. And nobodies that we've never seen before with the Dusks are fighting the Heartless. Yeah, 
Nice confidence, Pete. Uh, I agree. Oh, they killed all the Heartless. But I'm pretty sure Maleficent could kill them herself. I mean, she's powerful enough. Or she could run and leave it to us. Whatever. Oh, they're not all dead. So now we're fighting Heartless and nobody's in the same room, huh? That's fine. Kill them all at once. They're not going to work together. Probably just attack the nobodies whenever they're not attacking us. I don't know if the one there has a reaction command. The female one. The nobody, I mean, of course. Oh, we almost got Rising Sun! Oh, Ah, damn it! Oh, the red ones. I hate the red ones! Take that! Oh. Well, that takes care of them. That was easy. Really easy, in fact. Almost depressing himself. Well, not really. Um... Hi again. Where's Maleficent? She left. Looks like she ran away. Well, that was the feeling of her. I agree. I guess we picked the wrong side. Indeed. Group meeting. No, I've already looted that. Really, Donald? Donald. <laughs> See, that's something I share with these little fairies. I love treasure. He did not. And anything they had worth taking, I already took. So, yeah. Well, why would you lie to him? I mean, I, you definitely need help, but come on. That's just mean. By the way, we're approaching one of my favorite parts of the game. Oh, we have more nobodies. Yeah. And by the way, earlier when I said that, I did mean... Space Pyramids, that's one of my favorite. Oh no. It's... It's... <laughs> Are they gonna do it, or did I already do it? In editing. We also kicked his ass in Kingdom Hearts 1. I'll do it again. Then you must understand now. Just what are you going to do to him? Nothing. The cloud is the one who hungers for darkness. He said he's got a score to settle with you. I see. He wants to meet me again. So you're just going to... Then I shall meet him when he wants. That last bit of light is always the hardest. Okay. Why did he appear in a blast of light and now disappears in darkness? Confusion! Oh, and we can save again, but I recently saved, I think, so we're just going to move forward. And help our friends. What's Aerith doing? What? Oh look, more of these. I believe the name is actually Dancers. One of the cool things about Nobodies is they have very simple names. Easy to remember and understand. Dusk, Samurai, Berserker, Dancers, Creepers, all very easy. 
And I'm pretty sure these do not have a reaction command. Which I think I said earlier. Oh, hey, hey! Damn it, I hate when they do that. Ow! Damn it! Ooh, strength and magic buff. Now what are we fighting? Oh, more of them, okay. Heartless to the front of us. Nobody's behind, here I am, stuck in the middle with you. Even though technically it's left and right, but in this case it's front and back. Ow! Take this! Oh my god, when will they end? Or do they just never end and we have to keep fighting forward? We probably just have to keep fighting forward and I'm being dense. Because this seems like the exact same amount. You know what? This is a perfect scenario for this. Oh, it was a, it was a fine eye amount. Okay. Okay, where is the Bailey? Oh wait, no, we remember where the Bailey is. It's where we fought those nobodies before, when we first came here, the Hollow Bastion. Oh, and they're just gonna fast travel me there. Damn it! I was hoping to look in that one area to see if there was treasure. Oh well, I guess we can always come back here for that. Damn, the Bailey got trashed. Well, I guess we'll just move forward. Meanwhile, out over the horizon, an army of heartlesses in wait. A heartless march. A thousand by a thousand. Hurrah, hurrah. I was going to say two by two like the song, but that is clearly not two by two. That is definitely at least a thousand. Tired, Yuffie? Thank God Aerith has Kiriga. Otherwise, you might be screwed. Explain why she doesn't have a weapon, because she's a healer. Stitch! That is so cool. And the three fairies. So it takes three of them to take down one heartless. Fair enough. I mean, they're kind of small. If... Whoa. Stampede. If they were their, you know, proportionate human sizes, I'm sure they could do more than that. I love this, that line so much. <laughs> I love those lines so much. Well, that should be easy enough for him to take care of. But... Oh my god! <laughs> Again! I'm not playing his theme, which kind of makes me sad, but whatever. I understand you're definitely overcompensating with that really long-ass sword. I don't think it's that simple. You can try. My sword is longer than yours, therefore it's better. Again, I don't think Cloud's hair is spikier than Sora's. That's so. 
I don't think that's your backstory. I mean, I'm not an expert on Final Fantasy VII, but I'm, I don't think that's accurate. Yeah, or maybe it is. Not entirely sure. By the way, her name is Tifa. If you look in the journal, you can learn her name, but oh my god, she's a badass. I mean that. You know, most people fight the Heartless with a weapon. She just kind of punches the crap out of them and kicks them. Drink a Magni 